Yo, what is up guys? It is Quasi here and today I'm bringing you something that you haven't seen to my channel yet and that is a game of Gun Game. Now I haven't played Gun Game since Black Ops 1. I know next Call of Duties or the previous Call of Duties or the Call of Duties after Black Ops 1 did have Gun Game in but I never actually attempted doing it, I never tried it. So I, this is gonna be my first gun game since Black Ops 1. Now I used to religiously play this, I used to play this all the time, certainly after um, prestiging. Uh, I didn't always play gun game, but I always used to play like the wager matches. I loved betting COD points for things. I always used to do the high roller though. I always found that was the most pressurized thing to do. Um, so, yeah, no, so I enjoyed doing that. I thought it was a lot of fun. Um, okay, anyway, this could take a while. Anyway, guys, let me skip um, to um, let me skip to when I actually join a match because I think this could take a while finding something. Yo, so what is up, guys? Anyway, like I was saying, um, I have not actually done a gun game before. So this is actually, like I said, it was my first ever gun game. So let's give this a go. Something I haven't done on Black Ops 3 yet, which is pretty amazing, because I used to love it. Certainly on Black Ops 1, in the, uh, in the wager stuff. All right. I didn't know it gives you... It's pretty... Oh, it gives you radar straight away. I'm... Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, guys, but I don't remember in Black Ops 1 it ever having radar always on. All right, so what next? Okay, so we got the L car next. All right, it's going to come out of here. Thank you, now I need the shotgun, the KRM, I hate using this when I was going for dark matter. Where did he go? Oh, I think he's down below. Oh, there's a shotgun one as well. Uh, so that's what I mean, a shotgun one, what about? There you go, don't just run past him. Oh, I'm so bad with the Argos, I'm so bad with shotguns, guys. That was honestly, to me, probably one of the hardest things about going for dark matter. I hate you doing the shotguns. I'll go on a little streak here. Ah! Oh, double bursted him. How's he not died from a two burst? That's crazy. Anyway, guys, like I was saying, I used to play this so much in Black Ops 1. I used to love doing. Well, I thought I wasn't going to kill him there. I used to love doing all the. Um... Wow, that's unbelievable. I used to love doing it. Um, in Black Ops 1, I used to actually play a lot of it. After Prestige, and give you something else to do. I used to love doing the the, the high ones as well. Like the, um, what was it? The, oh, I'm going on a tear here now, guys. I can't even finish my sentence. I'm just, oh, I see M16. What was that? Shiva, oh God. Uh, oh, I find it so hard to speak, guys, when I'm concentrating. Uh, but anyway, guys, that's what I was saying. I used to play this a lot in Black Ops 1. I used to do it a lot. It was something to do, but I used to always spend, like, the big money. I used to love going for it. I never used to, like, doing, you know, the little money because I always felt it was it was slightly boring going for something, like the anti-up or something. I think it was the anti-up. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but what I wish they would do is... Uh, I have seen it actually on... I'm not going to take credit for this. I have seen it on a few things. Ali A, T. Martin... Um, White Thirst as well has talked about it about obviously on gun game and things like that maybe betting betting like um, COD, COD points or something like that would be a little bit more fun because yeah, everyone loves um, everyone loves betting um, using the the, uh, the not the COD points what do you call it the, the crypto key stuff crypto keys because um, you know everyone loves opening crypto keys and I think it would be a good trait to do you know to bet those um, oh god SVG I'm not a fan of SVG but actually I don't mind the SVG I just don't like it with the red dot I like using the proper scope okay and I've got someone head glitching me there I want to get him now yeah I can't use the red dot SVG as you can probably tell guys um, but yeah no I really wish that they bring something to it that you can bet I think that'd be a lot a lot lot funner certainly to oh I hit him wow okay alright so what are they doing oh there's a few behind can't pop around that corner where are you oh I'm certainly wow I've slowed up I was uh, winning quite easily before Slow him down. 
so not to go. Oh, I need to you think you can't sneak up behind people? That's the thing. I'm not sure if I like this radar. Certainly when you got the knife, how can you sneak up on people? Oh, now I've got to beat someone down. Yeah, I just got to beat someone down. I'm guessing that's the last one. That's quite hard to beat someone down. Ah, uh, one. Yeah, oh, I was about to have beat down with that guy. Anyway, guys, obviously the commentary was a little bit off. It's, uh, I've never really had to do that before. That is one of my first times I've actually tried to sort of do a live com. It's a little bit tougher than I thought it was going to be, purely for the fact that I spent my time concentrating and I found like I, I was repeating myself. So, guys, I do apologize for that, but that was my first ever gun game on Black Ops 3. That was really fun. Uh, guys, if you enjoyed watching it, enjoyed the gameplay, um, then let me know in the comment section below and let me know if this is something that you want to see more of. Um, but anyway, guys, if you did enjoy it, don't forget to subscribe for more. Also, leave it a like, guys, as it really does help the channel. Follow me on Twitch and Twitter. The links will be in the description below. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And as always, this has been Quasi. Have a wonderful day and see you in the next video.